welcome back to the Nerdy Collector and today I'm going to be bringing you a haul video. Now this is a haul of stuff I recently required, like basically I required it today. A friend was selling half of his pop collection, like lots of ones he didn't want anymore. So just I think he just needed a bit of money and um, I offered to buy them from him. And he done me a solid deal of £5 a pop. Some of them are out of box, some of them are in box. So I'm going to show you guys what I managed to pick up for a £5 each. Some of them I got really good steals on. And uh, I really do appreciate him selling me for that cheap. And um, let's waste no time, guys. I'm going to do the ones out of box first. So the first pop he sold me for £5 was this Iron Fist. This is the Iron Fist variant. It was out of box. And it's the one where he's uh, he's got like a see-through fist. So that's really, really cool. And that's another great pop for my collection. A nice Iron Fist. I don't have one of those, so that would look really good in a little Defenders um, setup. And the second out of box pop he sold me was this. This really nice Daredevil pop. I really do like that. For £5, I'm not going to knock it. It was out of box, but I'm still not going to knock it for that. That's fantastic. He also sold me this Bad 8 pop. This is from the Planet of the Apes films. This is a really, really cool one. I did get the Maurice and Caesar. I do have those in my collection already, but I didn't pick up this Bad 8. I was with him when he bought it, actually, because there was one left. So lucky enough, I didn't, because I managed to pick it up for £5. It's outside a box, which is fantastic for me. And um, I'm going to put it in with my other two... Planet of the Apes Pops. Then I managed to pick up these two from the Sons of Anarchy, this Gemma Pop and this Clay Romaro Pop. Now these two are fantastic. I really do like Sons of Anarchy, I'm a big fan. And um, look, it's even got the Sam Crow Sons of Anarchy ba badge on the back of Clay. And I've not, I've seen these, this one for about £10. I've never seen this one. They're outside a box, but this is great. I really did want these. I didn't want him to send them to someone else because I would have these two Sons of Anarchy Pops in a heartbeat, and I have. And the last three Pops he sold me out of a box were from Game of Thrones, and it's one of the dragons there from Game of Thrones. I can't remember the name off by hand, but that's one of the ones he sold me out of a box, that nice dragon there. Then he also sold me Grey Worm, which I'm really pleased with. I really do like this pop. And that's really cool. A nice addition to my Game of Thrones collection. Most of my Game of Thrones stuff is out of box. And then he sold me this really cool looking White Walker. I really, really like that pop. That's a great pop. This is probably one of my favourite ones of the out of box ones I've picked up for £5. And uh, I'm really pleased with that one as well. Sticking with the Game of Thrones theme, this is stuff that he sold me in box. And it is this Harpy Pop. That was, again, everything here was £5. So that, that was really cool pickup, a really good steal for me. Then I also got this Ned Stark, which I'm really happy with. Don't have Ned, a really cool addition to my collection. Really do like that pop. And another pop from Game of Thrones is Jorah Mormont, which I picked up as well, which is fantastic. These are pops I would have all definitely picked up in the end for my Game of Thrones collection. But you know when you, you see a pop, you think, I'll get that another time because there's something better. These are those sort of pops, and I'm glad I waited because I've got all three of those Game of Thrones in box of £15, which is fantastic. Fantastic. I'm really, really pleased with this collection. And then with a slight bit of box damage, but it's all right, I'm going to display it out of box anyway. It is Wun Wun, the giant, the big six inch pop as well, which had a price tag of £15 on it. When he sold it to me, I picked it off and I paid £5. So I'm really pleased with that. Slight box damage there. But like I said, he's coming out of the box and he's going to go in my Game of Thrones collection. And um, that's really awesome. I really like this pop. It's really cool. I've had it out of box and all those arrows in it. It looks fantastic. Something I don't think I would have picked up, but I'm so glad I've got it now. Then we've got two full conventions exclusive pops here with damage boxes. Um, this one here, this K2SO uh, full exclusive. The only problem is at the bottom of the box there is a bit, de uh, bit dented up here. But not a problem. For £5, I'm definitely having that because that was about £15 new. Then if I keep it in the box, I can just stand it on that and it looks absolutely perfectly fine. So that's a really great steal and a great find for me. This one is a bit more damaged box up here. It's ripped here, as you can see. He does have a young child and he's probably got older some of these. But it's okay. I can live with that damage. For an exclusive, um, we got this. He, I was with him at Comic-Con and this was the full conventions exclusive as well. So that was £15. Paid a fiver for it. And even if I display it out of box because of the box damage either way for me that's worth five pounds i'm really really happy with that whole pop down to the final few i picked up from him now um he does have actually quite another lot of stuff to sell so um i might post a link to some of the stuff if he's selling it on here because he's selling it all for five pounds so i'll keep you guys informed if you're interested message me below and i'll let you know what other what stuff he's got i know he's selling a lot of stranger things pops a lot of other things so he's selling them for five pounds each some of them box damage some of the stuff's out of box but a fiver each plus your shipping so let me know in the comments below and I'll let you know I'll give you a list of what stuff he is actually selling um, he sold me this Black Panther £5 I'm happy with it uh, I've got the Black Panther from the new film and I wanted this Civil War one because I've got lots of the Civil War pops on the back I never picked that one up see it everywhere 
but I'd rather give him the money than the shop. He had a lot of Stranger Things ones, and the one I was interested in the most was Barb. I've got the whole Stranger Things set, nearly every single character except the new ones have just come out, except Barb. I've even got the uh, eight bit of Barb on pre-order, but I didn't have the normal Barb, and I hung on and hung on till I brought it, and I'm glad I did for a reason, because I picked him up for a fiver. Right, and then uh, I've got a, I brought a pop ride from him as well. I mean, the box is absolutely beyond salvageable. It was smashed when he brought it. Look, it's all dented in, but he paid 15 pounds for this. It was 28. I was at Comic Con with him and it was in like a damage bin because look, it's all completely destroyed. But it's the crystal ship with Jesse inside. I'm going to display this out of box. For five pounds, I'm not going to turn away a Breaking Bad crystal ship. It's a shame the box is in mint condition because I know it's worth a bit of money. But with the damaged box, it's not worth anything at all. But to me, it's, it's definitely worth five pounds and I'm really glad I've managed to pick this up. I might do a review on all of these pops. You let me know what you think in the comments below if you'd like to see reviews on any of them. Leave the ones out of box I'll do reviews if you guys want but just drop me a comment below and let me know and last but not least he sold me this pork chase for, for the price of five pounds which is a bargain I do have it already but the reason I brought this guys is because I am very close to 200 subscribers I think at the moment it's 194 when I reach 200 subscribers a video will be going up of this in a giveaway I'm gonna give you guys the chance to win this chase pork it's mint in box there's actually nothing wrong with this box he kept this one pristine I will keep it safe and ready to ship out to one of you guys if you win and um, details that to come as soon as I hit 200 subscribers I will be giving this pop away there will be a competition you have to follow me on Twitter and Instagram subscribe leave a comment like the video that I put up at the time but all the details will follow and you can win this chase pork so if you do want this guy stick around to this channel and it will be coming hopefully very soon depending on the next six people subscribing so if you watch this video and you aren't a subscriber hit that subscribe button for a chance to win this so thanks for watching this video guys it's just a whole video just me rambling on about all the stuff i picked up overall i think i spent about 60 to 70 pounds on all this he gave me a deal i think about 70 quid so i'm really really pleased so uh, thanks for watching guys hit that thumbs up button if you like some of the stuff i got and you enjoyed this video like I said, let me know in the comments if you want any of this stuff reviewed. If you're interested in buying anything, I can let you know what he's selling. And um, yeah, let me know in the comments. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Um, links in the description below. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button because the 200 subscribers, as soon as I hit that, I'm gonna do the uh, um, I'm gonna do the giveaway for the Chase Pork. So um, make sure you hit that notification bell as well and hit that subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And uh, I'll see you next time, guys. Bye bye.